All right, and welcome to T-Shirt Weekly. This is one of our video segments, of course, because you're watching this. And we are here at the Atlantic City Arts Garage inside the showroom for the culprits. And we're here with designer, we were the main designer, the head designer, uh, Victor. Uh, thanks for taking time out of your busy schedule to talk to us and show us around your showroom. Yes, thank you. Thank you, man. Thank okay, you. so uh, how long have you been designing t-shirts? Um, roughly now, about 10 years. Okay. Yeah, I always had a, an eye for those things, but didn't really get active until about 10 years ago. Okay. Now, I, I'm an artist as well and, and a t-shirt designer. Out of all the different ways that you could create art, why did you decide to choose t-shirts as opposed to canvases? Good question. You know, um, I, first of all, I was always artistically inclined, but it's something that I guess I didn't practice for so long. Right. And then um, years later, I moved to Atlantic City when I was 13 years old. Um, Ten years later, I went back home, which is Los Angeles. And I realized in that gap of 10 years, um, I noticed a lot of shirts in Los Angeles that were in the neighborhoods, more like the homies had made them. They right. said Los Angeles had their own writing and stuff. And, it, and it, it kind of made me realize before that we were wearing a lot of Raiders and Dodgers to represent the city. By the time we went back 10 years later, it seemed like the locals were just getting more active with the scene itself. So um, it, I, know, I realized that it was something that in Atlantic City we didn't have. Right. You know, um, we had the shirts on the boardwalk, which is on, like the novelty shirts. Right. But there wasn't really like anything that said Atlantic City. For some reason, it just felt like there's a, there's a void there, and I right. just felt right. like shirts were the. Uh, it would allow me to not only get a little artwork going, but at the same time fill fill that fill that gap. Of, like, well, Atlantic that, City T-shirts, you know. What I mean? And that's why we started T-shirt weekly to focus on some of the little known uh, or you know catchy Star Wars or Wu-Tang shirts that might right, be out there right. but also to talk about hot cool shirts right. that you can only get at particular places if you know about them. Right, so right. that's why I'm happy to be here at the no, culprits that's awesome. That's awesome. because the shirts that you get here you you're not going to find at Walmart no, or JCPenney you're, you're only going to find them right here. Online on our website at theculprits.com or at the Arch Garage here in Atlantic City. Um, we don't do retail. There's not any other stores you could buy them and uh, right now I guess that's kind of like working for our advantage. Uh, it's good. It's an oversaturated market and it kind of gives us our own lane right now so you know it's okay a, it's a cool thing you know it's working now here's a shirt that's pretty cool respect atlantic city 609 you want yes. to tell us a little bit about that shirt well respect atlantic city i mean hey, I, i'll give you i'll give you the, the secret it came from um i was there's these shirts that said detroit versus everybody compton versus everybody I've seen um, Nike did a campaign with the street ballers that said Harlem against the world, Brooklyn against the world, Queens against the world. So I was like, wow, we need something like that. Um, I didn't want to copy what they were doing, right. but I guess the message, I wanted a, a nice bold shirt that said Atlantic City and respect just kind of fit right in. And um, the letters itself, I went a complete, like very simple, um, traditional, old school, Rec League. Yeah, I mean, it know. looks. It almost looks like a Rec League I shirt from '72. Exactly what I wanted. Uh, some old high school gym shirt that you printed, and that's <laughs> the look that I was going for. And um, to my surprise, uh, we only did released this shirt. Uh, my friend was uh, my friend Jason Forslund was um, pushing a campaign for a skate park in Atlantic City. Okay. He was going to be in the press, and he wanted to wear one of our shirts. So I said, I got a shirt for you. You know, so <laughs> yeah. we did respect Atlantic City for that newspaper article, but that was 2013. It's now 2018. And the reason why this shirt is here is because the locals would not like stop asking for it. I can't stop printing this shirt to save my life. Like I cannot wow. even keep them in stock as much as I want to. Um, it's a shirt that just kind of took a life on its own and that's thanks to the support of the local community, I guess. Wow. Just filling with the times, you know, so. Great. Like Atlantic City. Great. And we also made some hats for it, kind of running low on them, but. Okay. We just yeah. kept running with the campaign. 
you know, so that and was it's, it's been a winner so far. Ah, it's been cool, yeah. It, it, it really it really has. Um, right. We made some pins and stuff like that. Uh, a few of the local politicians wore some of our pins okay. um, during their campaign, which was cool because we were biased. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I mean, we were not biased to everybody. Okay. We, we just wanted to put the message out there for you. Okay. So, yeah. And to show you how real this is, my phone is ringing and I'm not even answering it. Right. So, got, you know, we're not on the sound stage. We are really <laughs> in the showroom and I really forgot to shut yeah. my phone off. And this is take two, so this is not rare. <laughs> okay. Okay. Awesome. All right. So if somebody wants to come and see your showroom, you're located at the Arts Garage in Atlantic City, but you also have a virtual showroom yes. via the website, right? Yes, yes. Give that out one more time, okay, please. Okay. So the website is www.theculprits.com, and the store is located inside the Arts Garage on 2200 Fairmont Avenue in Atlantic City, which is right on the other side of the walk and all that shopping area right there. So Mississippi. Great. In Fairmont, you can find us here from uh, so hours are 11 to 6, uh, Wednesday through Sunday. There you go. Yes, All right, Victor, thank you so much All for right, taking time you. to talk to us, yes. and um, yeah, thank you for being a part of uh, T shirt weekly. Thank you, thank you, appreciate it.